3D gate analysis is a method that allows us to quantify the kinematics or the movement of the human body. When you look at a product like the MBT, you want to understand how this MBT changes the movement. This is Henrik, our test subject. He is standing currently on a force platform. A force platform is like a scale. It measures the forces acting on the feet of Henrik. In addition to that, he has these markers here. These markers are used to quantify the movement. So if he moves an arm a little bit, then these markers move, and we can quantify that and we can then determine what the effect of these shoes is with respect to the movement of the body. The project that we were doing, we wanted to know how do people balance and is that different if you wear an MBT shoe or not an MBT shoe. So what we did was we used standard motion uh, tracking systems where we can determine the, the motion and the posture of our subjects um, as, as they move. We then used a mathematical method to decompose that movement into different types of movements. We know that there are different strategies that we have when we balance ourselves. So another variable that's commonly of interest for us is muscle activity whenever we're measuring these sort of studies. Uh, the method that's commonly used is electromyography. So for the example we're showing here today, we use three different muscles. We have the tibialis anterior, peroneus longus, and gastrocnemius medialis while hence is walking. From here, you can see the bursts of activity in the muscle as he walks, showing you that that muscle is active during that part of the gait of stance. So from there, we can compare within walking or else in standing or different types of movements, how much muscle activity we're seeing in different products. The data analysis is one of the important things why people come to us, because we have developed methods that are state of the art in the world we are the leaders in that part of, of research.